Hi everybody, this is Joni. Um, I was asked to be in a collab by Ninju and um, the collab that um, she chose was to do a planner spread um, with the theme of the state that you live in. So I live in New York, so I did a New York spread. So I'm showing you the, um, the full spread here, but I'm gonna um, take it apart and go into some sections. So I'm gonna bring you in closer. And this section here just has um, New York, which is our state fruit. Um, they call us the Big Apple. This is just a bumper sticker, I love New York. And this is um, the Empire State, it says. And the, we are sometimes referred to as the Empire State because of our wealth and um, resources. We have um, huge finance, financial institutions and stock markets that operate out of Manhattan and New York. Um, so I'll bring you down. Oh, yeah, that. So other names that were called is um, the Big Apple, I told you, the Empire State, and um, another name that were called is Gotham City, which um, is home of Batman. Our state capital is Albany. Our state fruit, as I said, was um, apple. Our state flower is the rose. So um, I'm going to... Oh, the... Um, Statue of Liberty here. She um, measures from ground level to the torch 93 meters and she was a gift to us from France and um, that's the first thing that immigrants would see when they came in on the boat and were um, traveling to Ellis Island. Ellis Island was was an inspection station for immigrants from 1892 to around 1954. Um, Ellis Island for a long time was considered part of New York, but um, in 1998 the Supreme, the Supreme Court actually decided that more of Ellis Island was in New Jersey. Um, my parents, both of my parents are Irish immigrants and they came over on the boat and we're th went through Ellis Island. And it is um, a tourist attraction now. You can go into the inspection station, um, but there was a hospital affiliated with it where they um, kind of in uh, isolated people who came in that were ill until they were better. And, um, but you can't go into the hospital, just um, Ellis Island like the inspection station. So um, I'm going to move on to a lower section here. And this is supposed to be a globe. And this is an airplane and it says JFK, John Fitzgerald Kennedy, JFK Airport. Um, this is the New York City skyline. This is a sticker that says you are here, just trying to be funny. And again, New York with the city skyline. Um, so, um, things that you can see, um, well, if you see, I have here Broadway and I have Times Square. Now in Times Square, a lot goes on and, um, we are the city that never sleeps. The lights are never out in Times Square. Um, in Times Square, you can, um, it, it, it's a pedestrian only area. Um, cars don't travel through there. They go around it. But it's there that you can go to see, to get tickets to see a Broadway play um, the day that you're seeing the play. And you can usually get very discounted um, prices. You may not get to see the play that you had in mind, so you would go in there with an open mind, you know, about, um, you know, which, say, five plays you'd like to see. And you'll probably be able to get tickets for one of them at a very discounted price and very good seats. Um, also in Times Square, we have the Naked Cowboy, which is a very famous man. He, um, he, he's in Times Square around noon. Um, he walks, he's a street performer. He walks around at any time of the year, winter, spring, summer, fall, in his underwear, like, um, 
tidy whities like the, not the boxers, but the, I don't know what men call those, um, the tidy whitey underwear. But um, he walks around with just a cowboy hat, a um, pair of underwear, and a pair of boots. And he's a street performer, like I said. He plays his guitar, and um, he makes a lot of money. People, you know, give him tips, and he is a very famous man. And um, you can usually find him around 45th Street and Broadway at noon. Um, they also have other characters there, like, say, Disney characters or, um, you know, you know those, um, oh, anything Bert and Ernie Disney um, you know any one of those large dress-up costumes um, you can find them floating around there and um, it's not um, it is not mandatory to give them a tip if you want to take a picture with them but it kind of is expected and um, some of them are not the nicest of um, friendliest and nicest of people they're pretty silent and they're looking for you know a couple of dollars for a picture with them um, let's see what else do I have here oh this is Broadway the lights and this was I was mim mimicking like a curtain you know the, as the curtains fall um, our sports teams are the Mets and the Jets the Mets are baseball the Jets are football um, we also have the Giants is football and the Yankees is baseball, but I'm not fans of those teams, so I didn't write them down. Um, so I have the baseball here for the Mets. Um, it's really hard being a Mets fan sometimes. Um, anyway, I didn't have a football to put in there. This is the word explore, and up top I have the word journey. Um, I put this gold wash, it's not washy, but this bling down here because Times Square is full of lights flashing all the time. Um, nothing closes around there. You'll always be able to find a store open around there and people in the streets and um, it's a lot of fun, the city. Um, what else did I want to tell you about New York? Um, oh, well, the Times, Times Square is where the ball drops, and um, I told you you can buy the Broadway tickets. Broadway is very near to Times Square. Um, oh, also in the city is MoMA, the Museum of Modern Art. Um, Macy's is in Herald Square, where the Miracle on 34th Street was filmed. Um, we have Radio City Music Hall, where the Rockettes are. And um, the Macy's Parade is in front of Macy's on 34th Street. Um, the Rockettes put on a, a knockout performance around Christmas time, the Christmas Spectacular. And um, what I don't have on here, and I wish I did, was the um, Freedom Tower. But um, there were no stickers of it, and my printer's not working so I couldn't print one out but you've all heard of the print the um, Freedom Tower it's it's really um, one of the twin towers and 9-11 site um, rebuilt and there is also a museum there and there is also um, a memorial site and all the names of the victims that were lost on 9-11 are etched into um, I don't know if it's marble or granite, maybe, I'm not sure, but, um, and it has a beautiful fountain, it's a memorial fountain, it's just a beautiful place, um, to see. I've never seen it, I've seen footage of it, I've driven past it, uh, you know, um, on a bus and in a cab, but I've never stopped and toured it, and I would like to do that someday soon. There are a hundred floors in the, um, Freedom Tower, and um, it is the sixth tallest building in the world, and it is, with 104 floors, the tallest building in the Western Hemisphere. So um, it was important to us, to our city, that it was built, well, to our country, that it was built up to still be a very tall building, um, just to show 
the terrorists that, you know, we're not backing down from any of this mess. Um, so, um, over here, I was trying to um, depict, well, the top is, um, this is New York. It's, you know, the, the state. This is a welcome to New York sign. The washi I used was explore, amazing, play. Um, this is just a general map, world map. And that says, live your life and travel as much as you can. This is um, well, our license plate, but actually since the sticker was made, it was changed to a yellow background and blue letters. Um, I think it's just more visible in, at nighttime. Um, this is Fifth Avenue. Fifth Avenue is where you have all your high-end shops, your um, Gucci and um, Jimmy Choo's and Coach. And you know you get the idea. A um, lot going on on Fifth Avenue, but as in any major city, it is congested. This is I tried to make this little car into a taxi. It is bumper to bumper, like I displayed here, bumper to bumper, bumper traffic, very busy. I have a traffic light here. Cars heading in this direction. Cars heading in that direction. Cars heading in that direction. Um, some cones, road cones, and um, there's one-way streets um, everywhere. There's um, the cars travel very fast, and uh, the taxis drive like crazy madmen. It is insane. So I don't like to drive in the city. My husband usually does that when we have to go in. I'm about an hour away from there, out on Long Island. Um, and Long Island is, out on Long Island, we are an island. Um, you have to, you know, take a bridge to get off of Long Island into Manhattan. Um, we have, um, out on Long Island, a lot of vineyards, a lot of beaches, um, a lighthouse in Montauk Point. We are um, on the Atlantic coast, and um, and that's where I live on Long Island. Anyway, um, very expensive part of the country to live in. When I retire, I'm leaving New York. Taxes are insane. Uh, nobody could afford them in their retirement. Um, this here is Central Park. That little sign there says Central Park. And this was supposed to be grass, but it doesn't really. It's sticker paper, glittery sticker paper. And again, that same washi on the bottom. But um, Central Park is enormous. I haven't seen all of Central Park. They have um, music venues there that do outdoor concerts. Some of the concerts are free. It's beautiful. There's jogging paths and bike paths and... Um, Oh, was it strawberry fields is there um, they have um, you could bring your blanket and have a picnic there it's it, it's huge it's just absolutely enormous and um, like I said I have not to this day seen all of Central Park yet um, they have um, horse uh, buggies that are um, horse driven buggies there that go through the park. I've gone, it's it's a really romantic thing to do. You know, around Christmas time, I usually go in and we see all the Christmas displays in Macy's window. We'll take a horse and buggy ride through Central Park. We'll go out and have a bite to eat, maybe even see the Rockettes um, at Radio City Music Hall. It's, it's beautiful, absolutely beautiful around the holidays. But um, that's New York in a nutshell. I'll come back to the whole page. That is New York. I hope you enjoyed my video. And um, down below, I will have linked all of the other girls who participated in the collab. I'll have their videos. So take a peek at theirs and subscribe. Bunch of great gals. Um, and um, that's it for tonight. Thank you so much for watching. And if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button and the little bell next to it so you can get my most current videos. And um, thank you so much, everyone. Good night. Yeah.